In this video, I am going to show you how you can call and use Hugging Face models through API from the inference endpoints. There are few models which you can access for free and then there are few models for which you have to pay. And you can simply access this information by visiting the Hugging Face page of that particular model. In order to access Hugging Face models through an API, the first thing you need to do is to create a free account with your email address. Once you have your free, mail, free email account, then log into Hugging Face website and I'll drop the link in the video's description. And then on the top right, click on your photo and then click on settings. Once you click on settings, you'll be presented with this face, then click on access tokens, click new token. If you just want to read, then simply select the role read and then give your token a name of your choice. You can, if you want to write something to Hugging Face, such as you want to apply, upload a new fine-tuned or trained model, or you want to apply, upload a data set, then you can go with the right one. But for simple API inference, just go with the read one. I already have one, so as you can see here. Now, that is done. Now, let me show you the code which you can use in order to access a Hugging Face model through API. Let me go to my VS Code Editor. So this is my VS Code Editor. Let me first walk you through the code. All I'm doing is importing the request module and then I am giving the URL of this model. This could be URL of any of the model from Hugging Face which you want to access. Then paste here the Hugging Face token which you have just copied. Now this model name, I'm not using it, but if you want to give a model name because you have another API call, you can give it here. This is just for testing, I'll remove it. And then here is your prompt, which is, I'm just asking it why line is king of jungle. And then I'm passing it header with the bearer token in authorization, as you can see here. And then this is a simple function, which is calling that URL with the post function of request module. So I'm passing it this URL, then headers with the token and then payload, which is our prompt here. Now, this, after calling this payload, which is being passed here, as you can see that this is my query function and this is what I'm calling here in line number 18 and I'm passing it the prompt which I have mentioned above and then I'm printing out the output. So let me run it. So I'm pi hugging face, press enter and there you go. So I'm just asking it why line is the king of jungle and it has given me a response. So let's not worry about the response, whether it is good or not, because it is simply a distal GP2 model so I'm not really uh, interested in uh, whether quality of the response because it seems really like a weird one anyway but the point of this um, post is to just to show you how you can do this thing um, model access on hugging face from your code easily uh, and uh, very very nicely through the API call and you can do a lot of things here now another thing I wanted to show you that what happens if you have a model which requires uh, money for example let me quickly take you to the hugging face website for example if you want to access this dolphin mod model which is a variant of mixed role with which is again a, a mixture of experts from e hartford and if you go to inference endpoints so these are uh, sorry this on the right hand side click here and then there you go so you would need to put in a credit card because these inference endpoints for these paid models are fully managed infrastructure. So you would have to pay. It's not that much again, but still it's not free. And there are, as I said, there are a few free models which you can search from Hugging Face website by cl clicking here, going to the models or searching here. And then you will get to know if it's a free or not. So that's it guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you're still stuck, any questions, or if you know of a better way, let me know and I will be happy to do it. And if you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you.